Good day ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome to another episode of How To Football Manager 22. Today I am going to show you how to download logo packs. So if you're annoyed with the fake Liverpool or the fake Real Madrid, Barcelona logos, well, this is for you. So let's jump right in. This is the first time I'm actually doing it. I've always had an interest to do it, just probably too lazy. So this is a great opportunity for me to do it. So uh, we're going to go into fmscout.com. And so you seem to be for more, more organized website you, there is other ones like fm base but i just find it fm base is just feels more of a forum I, f I think this is how they all started off but fm scout is just tidy it's a tidy interface it's easy to find stuff where do we need to go if we go to add-ons and then go down to logo packs or you can just press on add-ons and it will take you straight to all of them so there's two downloads but only one's available and that's for b logos the reason why for um standard logo pack on the bottom here isn't available is because of some sort of licensing uh, because they're too real so stan from who created fm scout has created his own and made them look like for logos but in a way that it's not too lifelike which is 100 times better than what you normally get anyway so let's go into this as you can see there's a massive download now so we'll do that in a minute but let's just quickly have a look what we get here as you can see he's made them by hand himself so what do we get you can read it at your own leisure 43 leagues are fully covered in 3.4 okay so some of them could be still quite old but i think it's been updated to be able to put into football manager 20 22 but some badges do look older than what they should be i mean chef wednesday you know what i love that badge though but it looks better like premiership look at that it looks so much better there's instructions down on the bottom but sometimes people just like to watch right so we go this pc documents sports interactive as you can see i've already got some football managers there but we want to go to the latest one football manager 2022 so new folder graphics and within there another new logo graphics is now in there and logo now you know what i don't know if it makes a difference but just looking at all the other folders they all they don't start with a capital letter so just never know never know to be safe so we are gonna download now so it's a zip i will just i just double click evaluation copy because I don't actually think I have the zip. So I'll see if this will zip it for me. So extraction path and options. So you want to go to your document, Sports Interactive, Football Manager 2022, just as we created, graphics, logo, select on logo, and go OK. Make sure that's done. That's now going to extract that into there. And it should look like that in your folder. Let's have a look. Graphics, logo, and there you go. Brilliant. So we can close. That one done and we've got that right games now loaded up so into game preferences uh interface so i went to interface and i couldn't see clear cache but if you go down to the reset button you can see clear cache is there clear cache yes it's fine ah, reload skin when confirming changes in preferences is that what it is Conf uh there we go it's doing something Ah, there you go. Like you can see the Barcelona badge. It's quite funky, though. Right? Man United. Hmm, not bad. Yeah, if you get League One. Oh no, Chef Wednesday's still there. Okay, cool. It's funny how it's written over Chef Wednesday. Guess if they've moved leagues, it's going to overwrite it. Maybe. Don't know. And let's go to, so in our Barcelona save. There you go. Oh yeah, it looks much better than what we had before. Yeah, well, there you go. That is how you do it. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you would like to watch more videos like this, please subscribe. And to be notified, click on the bell.